Ramsey. Legit hustles, man. Get money. And and for my niggas that do hustle, I'm gonna put y'all on some shit real quick. Like I was telling my young boy the other day, yo, I told my young boy the other day, next time you get 20 grand, bring that shit to me, bro. Next time you got 20 grand, instead of leaving it in your shoebox, bring that shit to me. Because this is what you do with 20 grand. You take 20 grand, right? Go buy a little crib. A crib that could be fucked up. But nine times out of 10, when you're buying a crib for 20,000, mm-hmm. it's probably worth 35, 40,000. Okay. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. So take that 20 grand that you got sitting in your shoebox and just go buy a crib and just let it sit. Because you got $20,000 sitting right there. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Just let it sit. Because you would have did some right? sh- other shit it's with it. Because it's sitting right there, right? Mm-hmm. If, you, if you got the money to fix it up, fix it up, rent it out, flip it, whatever. But even if you don't have the money, if it's your only 20, put it in that crib. You know why? Because. When you got that money sitting in your shoebox and you see it and it's accessible like that, eventually you're going to spend it. it. Especially yeah. if you get fucked up, you're going to spend it. Mm-hmm. But it's just been sitting, just like money sitting in the bank. And never let money sit in the bank because it takes 72 years for your money to double sitting in the bank. It's called mm. the law of the 72. So never just let money sit in the bank because that little interest they give you, it ain't doing not like, It ain't doing shit, like I said earlier. You know what I mean? Definitely make your money work for you. You know what I mean? But um, look, back to what I was saying, you take that 20000 and you buy a crib. Now you got what's called equity. You know what I mean? So now sure. that $20,000 crib is basically worth 30, 35000 So you just turn that, you just flip that twenty into thirty five, and it's just sitting in the crib. About making so a now, if you get, now if you get fucked up, because you know niggas have ups and downs. Now if you get fucked up, right. you got a crib that's worth 35000 right. more than what you even put into it. So now you can go ahead and just sell that crib as it is, right. get thirty, thirty five thousand 35000 for it, and now you're back on your feet again. Right. Like that's how, you save, that's how you save money. That's how you flip money. Like That's the sure, thing you're supposed to put your money sure. into. Shit Don't just have your you. money just sitting. Even just build like, up I hate crib. money sitting around. Another hmm. thing, money's going obsolete. So, yo, start buying gold. You know what I mean? Invest in gold. Invest in silver. You know what I mean? Like, I, like me personally, I'm somebody that hate having money sitting around, yo. Like, I'm trying to, I'm about to go buy a Sprinter van and start doing like Sprinter van routes, like with the trucking company, just because, like, yo, like, I don't even, I don't like, I hate to have like 15 grand just sitting around. Right. Like, fuck that. I'm gonna go buy a Sprinter van. I'd rather mm-hmm. have my 15 grand. I'd rather that Sprinter van be my $15,000 right there. Than just right. sitting I know in the bank. Sooner, even if it's just sitting there, I'd rather it be sitting there instead of in the bank or in my closet or somewhere right. else. Right. Because at the end, because when I feel like it, I could just put that shit on the road, put my DLT stickers on there, and start running some routes and start making some money with that shit. And right. that fifteen grand going to come back whenever. Or if I don't want to do nothing with it, if I want to just hold on to it and just sell that shit, get my fifteen grand back whenever I want, cool. But I just, you know... Just money sitting around, like just make make your money work, man. Stay out the streets, make your money work, man. Have fun, you know what I mean. Enjoy life, man. Protect the black women, p- protect black kids. Don't be protect asking black these man. women for no you know I mean? fucking money. Don't Stop be asking, asking them for, for no money, yo. What money. the fuck is going on with that? Like, and if you is know. in the streets, bro, you might want to put that shit on hold because nobody want to go to jail during COVID, my nigga. <laughs> nah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> like, you don't want to be sitting don't. in work. jail during COVID. I heard shit is bad up there. Oh, man. I, can I believe it. That's shit is bad. Twenty three and one. Ugh, 100% niggas, you can't even avoid a nigga coughing on you. Well, <laughs> you know, that's all I got is.